It's time once again for Uncle Matt's bedtime story. Hello everybody, it's Uncle Matt, and I'm here to read you another bedtime story. And tonight's bedtime story is by Tom Fletcher. Earlier in December, we read a story called There's an Elf in Your Book. And I realized that this is a series. There's a whole bunch of different um, creatures and beings that Tom read, that sorry Tom Fletcher writes about. Um, but uh, we're going to read one today about There's a Monster in Your Book by Tom Fletcher and illustrated by Greg Abbott. This story was copyright, let's see here, in 2017. Are you ready? Here we go. Don't be frightened. Oh no, there's a monster in your book. Let's try to get him out. Shake the book and turn the page. Nice try, that knocked him over, but he's still in your book. Tickle his feet and turn the page. That didn't work. He's just laughing and he's still in your book. Try blowing him away. <sighs> Blow really hard and turn the page. That's better now he's far away, but he's still in your book. Tilt the book to your left. Now he's over here, but he's still in your book. Now tilt the book to your right. Hmm. He's hanging on. What a naughty little monster. Give the book a good wiggle. Good, now he's back over there. But there's still a monster in your book. Try, try what? Try spinning, ah, try spinning the book. Woo! Around and around. Look, he's dizzy. Quick, make a loud noise. Ah! It's working, he's running away. Make that noise again, but... Louder! Ah. Oh. He's gone. There isn't a monster in your book anymore. Now he's in your room. Quickly, call him back. Monster, come back! Look, here he is. He's coming back. Keep calling him monster. Come here, little monster. Ah. Phew, he's back in your room. You don't want a monster loose in your room. This book is probably the best place to keep him. Monster, you can stay here in this book. Pet monster's head and say good night. Good night, monster. Shh. Look, he's fast asleep. Gently close this book so he doesn't wake up. The end. Wow, that was scary with the little monster running around in your room. That is all the time we have for Uncle Matt's bedtime story. 
I hope you enjoyed that story. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.